Hey, Mark Rice here, and today I will show you how to rig your character. Simple and easy. You can download this illustration for free from the link below. So let's go. First, I need to import the file. So go here into the project tab, click with the right mouse button, then import file. Okay, pick up your file and here click import. Then select composition and layer size and click OK. Beautiful. Double click on the composition. And that's it. Hello, my fighter. <laughs> okay, so the next step. Choose different colors for these layers. I will select all the layers for the head. Go here and select red color, for example. Okay, cool. Then I will select the layers for the belt. Okay. And for these layers, I will pick up orange color. Okay, then body one and body two and body three layer. I will use yellow color. Then the layers for the arms. Okay. Uh, beautiful. Legs layer. Okay and shadow and the background I can I can use purple color and look at this I got the rainbow and it's much easier for work now okay so now I need to pair in the right shapes for example I will select all the layers for the head except face layer and connect these layers or parent these layers with the face cool now when I select the face layer Everything is connected right. Okay, and this is what I need. Now I will select right belt and left belt and connect it with the belt. I will connect the belt with the body one. And this is the body one. Okay. And I can connect the head with the body one as well. So select the face layer and parent it with the body one. Okay, cool. I will select body 2 layer and the body 3 layer and parent these layers with the body 1. And now the arms. So select the right hand, parent it with the right arm down. This layer. Cool. And now I will parent the right arm down with the right arm up. And the right arm up with the body 1. Okay, cool. Do the same with the second arm. So, left hand with the left arm down, left arm down with the left arm up, and left arm up with the body one. Okay, now right foot with the right leg down, and the right leg down with the right leg up. And the right leg up with body one okay cool okay okay and left leg up with the body one okay let me check now when i select the body one everything is connected <laughs> and i have one more step before i start with the rigging so now I need to change the anchor points for the shapes. For example, I will select this part of the hair. Okay, go here, select the pen behind tool and move it here. Okay. So now if I want to rotate this part of the hair, it will be rotated around this point here. Okay, cool. Oops, select the anchor point. And I will do that for the other parts as well. Okay. As you can see here, I have a lot of different shapes. So think where you need to rotate your shape and move that anchor point. Okay, something like this. I'm almost done. 
Okay. Now left belt and right belt. And that's it. Now we are ready for the rigging. So first select the right hand, then hold shift on the keyboard, select right arm down and right arm up. Okay, now go here into the Duke plugin and hit auto rig. And let me check. Okay, that's it. Beautiful. If you want to avoid this, just go here and unselect auto stretch. Okay. Now it's much better. I will do that with the second arm. Okay, auto rig. Let me check. Okay. If I move the whole body, okay. Dance, dance, dance. And now I will select the right foot, then right leg down and right leg, sorry, up. And hit auto rig. Okay, cool. Now second leg. As you can see, it's very simple and usually I need more times to prepare all these layers than for the rigging. So now I can rename the layers. So this will be left leg. Cool, then right leg. Okay, left arm and right arm. Okay. Let me check. <laughs> and basically that's it. Now you can play with your keyframes. So for example, I will select the body one layer, hit P on the keyboard, create the first keyframe, then go here and move the body something like this. Select the keyframes, hit F9 for the smooth animation, go here, select Alt, and type here loop, out, ping pong. Okay, that's it for today, I hope that you like it. If you like it, download that illustration and try it. And stay tuned, because the best is yet to come. Oh yeah. Peace.